think we have a lot of different goals um, this year. I think that we are a tremendously young team. And when you have that, I think it's really hard to just kind of zero on in on super specific goals. I think what you try to have when you have that, obviously we want to we want to win the MAC tournament, we want to go to the NCAA, we think we're capable of making it a team quite deep into the NCAA tournament. Um, because our young players have speed and tenacity and they're hungry, uh, it will be a matter of whether or not the staff and the older girls can bring them along as quickly as we hope to. You know, in this first couple weeks of practice, we feel that we're going to be able to do that. We have seen some really exciting things. Uh, another goal that we have, and, and that we have every year, which we don't like to talk about all the time, but we probably should talk about. Um, for years and years, we have been an IWLCA all-academic team um, with Team GPA well over 3.0. We want to continue with that, and with the class that we brought in, I have no worries about that. Our first semester grade with, grades with our freshmen were out of this world, so we are quite excited about even improving on our GPA of years past. Uh, and that's a national award, and that's something that we take really seriously. So those two things, I think, combined, um, if we can start to really kind of tailor some of our individual goals and our positional goals, I think that we can accomplish you know, the, the MAC championship. It, it's going to be fast and tenacious. Um, we are really looking to play a disruptive defense, which we, do, we call disruptive man, which means because we're quick, but not necessarily the most experienced team-wise, we are not going to sit back and let another team set plays on us, at least early on in the season. So when we open up with Salisbury and then we are follow up with Gettysburg, um, you know, one of the things, we're not afraid of anybody. We will play anybody, we're not afraid of anybody. We will play them tough, and we will play them aggressive. People don't like playing us because we're the wild card. Um, we don't typically play a traditional style, and this group won't either. So that, I think that is really exciting, and I think that's what, one thing that people would want to know. We're going to be really fun to watch. We're going to make mistakes in those first couple games, but we're going to cause a whole lot of turnovers at the same time. So um, I think they're going to be really fun to watch. Offensively, we've gone into a creative style of play because we have such talent there um, that we have very little scripting that we have to do with them. So they do a whole lot of freestyle play and uh, we've been happy so far. And it, I'm telling you, it's a battle at practice every day. When you play disruptive style man-to-man -man against a freestyle attack, it makes for exciting practices. <laughs> I think we're going to have a very different look than we've had in years past. Um, if we can tie it all together, this team will be special. If they become complacent and, and forget who they are, it could be a long season. Because when you have that youth, mistakes can turn into something very negative. We're trying to make, we're going to make a lot of mistakes. We're excited to make mistakes because it's going to really help us figure out who we are. So uh, we're, you know, we're pumped for these priests, you know, we're pumped for these priests to conference because I think we are, you know, we're at a point we can try so many different things with the athleticism we have.